Hi guys, this is AC Game. I'm back with another video on Counter Side. So in today's video, what I'm going to be doing is going over taking a look at a task force plan that will be coming to the global server, but right now it is available in the SEA server. So let's quickly take a look at it to see how much resources we can get, whether this is going to give us a lot more resources or is this going to be something interesting. So let's get right into it. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, stay tuned for more content on counter side. I will be making content on the KR version, the SEA version, as well as the global version. Right now, this video is planned for the sea and the uh, what's called global server as well so let's take a look at that okay i'm going over to the task force plan this is what we have right now so it looks like there's going to be one two three four okay luckily we can actually take a look at each individual one without it being unlocked so the beginners plan over here on uh, the first one you can get some xp um you can get some quartz okay that's great i'm actually requiring some quartz right now in my sea account um now let's see is there anything interesting in here is this what type of ssr gear is this um we can't really see okay we get the ssr john mason shard from here uh we also get some classified recruitment resources over here some resources you can use to challenge some um simulations summoning resources it looks like some ssr gear as well some xp um some shard for some um, sr units as well orca shard as well Oh, where was this when I needed it? Where was this? Um, obviously, right now with the rearming the SGA server being available, a lot of people already got their old car um, level for skills maxed out. But in a global server, when this comes out, this is going to be very, very useful. Definitely save all of this. Don't use that. Um, okay, this seems to be pretty good. So let's go ahead and claim this over here. There we go. I believe this increases blah, 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 blah. Okay, that's fine we'll claim that so thank you shall we get back to work now so i'm pretty sure i'm just going to be able to clear claim every single one of this because i've done this so this is just basically free resources obviously in the global server as well this is going to be something you guys can do um i believe if you guys have been playing since day one in the global server you should be able to unlock every single one of this as well if you guys want to look at the missions you need to do then i'm just going to be really going ahead and just scroll in so that you guys can pause the video and see the particular missions if you guys are interested actually this is good see a unit over here you will be using her for danger close um okay i need to do this danger close when you need multiple characters that's gonna be nice oh my days i don't even have do i just do one single that's kind of weird though let's see then but i want to risk a single on um okay just do one single there we go we didn't get lucky obviously it's a single what else were we expecting there we go go back um there was also changes added with the strategy battles i know a lot of people were wondering what type of changes will be done to strategy battles to make it a little bit more fun so we'll be taking a look at that right now as well um go over to strategy battles i haven't even claimed my resources uh for yeah i haven't claimed it i just realized i haven't actually entered pvp in a while um so before i actually do that let's take a look at the changes that were added to strategy battles to make it a lot more fun uh go over to here there we go so optimize the display of opponents defender team in strategy battles the complete lineup is displayed for diamond and below three random characters are not shown for masters and grandmaster and four random characters are not shown for challenger and the development resources recovery rate for the defending team is in strategy battles have been reduced from 27 percent to 15 percent i will gladly take this debuff because they were just yes yeah, spamming spamming i keep coming ahead over and over again it was just too much boss for the um, defending team um, other adjustments the deployment position of a character in gauntlet has been adjusted forward by 225 so you can actually move your characters a lot more further towards the enemy ship um, tell me if you think that's a good thing or a bad thing i'm not really too sure so when you win a an npc challenge you will receive the points according to the level of the npc team but not when you lose okay the on and off option in gauntlet auto battle has been changed to all gauntlets and only strategy battles i like that um optimize the text display and i think that's pretty much it so they fixed issues that were here but i'm pretty sure that's all the changes that were made that was made to strategy battles so let's see how easy it is gonna be and obviously if i do manage to lose this it's not because it was hard or the changes wasn't too enough it's just because i suck basically uh let's just go ahead and just see um we got this one i said i was gonna do this one so we go ahead and do that so the team i run in strategy battles is actually the mech team so we got this one making sure 
they all have the best gears on let's see nope no gear at all okay we'll just go ahead and give him this one over here there we go but this one we will give her this one let's see i think that is pretty much it so we're gonna go like this um so defender striker it's not healer so this is not gonna work well we can go with this one i guess get some more tanking in okay so i had to refresh it but we do have this opponent over here and thank you for this defense team because this seems relatively easy to do so let's go ahead and just do that right now so I've, yeah that's the right team let's go if this if i still manage to lose i would absolutely laugh i don't care i would laugh let's go ahead cancel auto um, i'm gonna run like this right here go like this strike a character ranger character will be next um should i bring well if i actually use this i'll laugh i honestly will laugh there we go and i think should be good so we've got some defense now all i need to do is wait for my king yeah okay we've done it we won thank you i guess we'll go with this team over here but i still think i'm gonna lose let's see the changes that were made in gauntlet right now now in the SES server we actually got ourselves a brand new SSR character unfortunately the character is not that good so I will not be summoning and I can't really place anyone here okay um, I need a striker character yeah I got really bad rolls it, it's, it's terrible this is bad rolls my king is gonna die there's no one I could use man I'm sorry king oh come on I didn't like this let's try and heal him up there we go yeah he's gonna die before he's even do it, able to do anything okay bring more like this yeah it was pretty bad hand I, I think they should not make this randomized once you do that it just makes it a lot like stupider in my opinion there we go we killed that um we need to bring out awaken king come on awaken king come here come in clutch there we go Awaken King is over here. Let's see. Do we have any opponents that we can use? We got Minister over here. That's pretty annoying. So we're just going to summon this. There we go. Little ultimate. Uh, push forward. There we go. Okay. It's a lot easier now. Looking at this. There we go. Bring this here. Bring this here. Okay. I like this. I like this. Okay. Um, I don't know. Um, I can't really feel too much change that was happening. I don't know whether I was just good in my placing for my characters. Or it's just because of the nerf they did to the characters. But yeah. This is a lot more manageable in my opinion there we go we managed to get that win um let's just go back and see what else we can get with the new um what's called task force plan let's see so the expert plan i actually didn't take a look at this so yeah more simulation stuff um some ship stuff as well okay nothing too much from the expert going over to the master plan i'm trying to find for i'm trying to see if there's actually something hype in this i don't know if this is an ssr gear or something but there's a lot of that in every single one. Oh, one free multi. That's good. But once again, it looks like more simulation um, entry ticket. Okay. Go over to the limited plan over here. Let's see. So we've got some fusion cores. We've got some um, binaries as well. Set binary. Only one though. Only 10, sorry. Um, okay. More fusion cores and a bunch of other stuff there. Okay. We've got one here over there. We've got this one over here okay um loads of fusion cores so that is actually quite good as well yeah you can get a character to level 110 with the fusion cores over here you can also get some um so what's called set binaries some gold a lot of useful resources so i'll gladly take all of this stuff over here so that is all i wanted to talk about in this video I've showing you guys the new task force plan showing you guys the new changes made to gotlert um, tell me down in the comment section if you guys are still enjoying counter side at the moment or tell me down in the comment section will you guys still be playing the strategy battles it's been a boy ac gamer and i'm out